I let the beat play for the first eight. Big Teniola, yeah, I'm really bait. What time is it? It's Teniola time, man. Welcome back to Teniola TV. What's going on, people? Hope you lot are all right. Hope you lot are feeling good today. It's another Saturday. It's another match day. I'm with my Lockwell boys, Alex, Brandon, and it's an away day, man. We got store market today, so we've left quite early. It's 10.30, we're about to head to the coach. Need to be there for 11 o'clock. But yeah, a little bit about store market. You know, they've had a bit of turmoil in the club. The manager left and, you know, that can always disrupt the team. It can either go two ways, either disrupt the team or it can make them do well. And I think they've gone on a little unbeaten run. I think four games or something. They're looking like they're in playoffs. So it's another big game, like I say, every week. It's another big game. Uh, probably be a big crowd today as well. But if we win today, we've officially beat every team in the league. We've taken three points, at least three points of every single team in the league, if we win today. Now that's crazy. I don't know if it's like a, a big stat or anything. I was talking to Toby this morning about it, but I don't know if it's like a, a, a mad stat, but it, it sounds mad anyways. It's getting to that point of the season now where we just need to finish up shop, man, and, and, and shut up shop and just get the points and, and win the league, man. But yeah, let's do it, man. Let's get on the coach. Bit shenanigans on the coach. Everybody loves an away day, apart from Toby. <laughs> See you later. Then it's good to set up. Then we just make up. Cause now we got a goal for the best next to wake up. That's real shit. Any little problem that you got, you know what I do with you. We've got some big plans. I was just not so sure. Angry guy. Yeah, this is the point. 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 I was just about to ask him what he had for breakfast this morning, but whatever he had, it's knocked him out. Mazza. What is he doing? There's only one game, I swear down. This guy is not normal. <laughs> look at this dude. Do I look like Vidal Riley? <laughs> I'm saying I look like Vidal Riley. A little bit. Thank you. Huh? Wait, you don't know who that is? Do I look like Vidal? Do you know who Vidal Riley is? I don't let him look at you. Do you know who Vidal Riley is? Shut him up, bro. Oh, it's your Come debut on. on my vlog, bro. Come on. Come on. Mama made it. Do you know who Vidal Riley is? Do you know who Vidal Riley is? Gladly. Yeah, he's a boxer, isn't it? Do I look like Vidal Riley? Nah, no. Vidal's a little bit looking. Yeah, you're not AT, you're your own brand. Thank you, man. Own Toby's brand. A donut, bro. Toby keeps doing a lot of Vidal Riley. It's a mug. Come on, man. Cheers, cheers. Big, big PB. Head on back. And we are underway. Hashtag United versus Stowe Market Town wearing the pink kit with the blue shorts today, Lewis. The goalkeeper and Nathan Smith just gets a vital touch there to keep it out of danger. It's difficult in those positions, but Stowe Market still got the ball. They swing it in. It's a header and they've scored. 
They've scored already, Lewis. Played in, let run and hit. And it has gone all the way in. We haven't really met the battle on the, on the pitch today. And here he has blown for half time. It is 2-0 to Stone Market. And we are back underway for this second half. The rain is now pouring. Hashtag with a lot of work to do. So let's get it done then, shall we? There it is. <laughs> wow, what a header. What a header. <laughs> Stone Market are going to break down the left-hand side. Tomo there in support. It's played across the box and it's 3-0. In typical PK fashions, about to try a little skill there as well. He's looking to swing it in with his left foot. Falls short, although Nathan Smith does win it. And now Kojo's flicked it on and now it's falling around into the edge of the box. Can AT get a shot off? Oh, we'll, get a corner, well, we'll get a corner. This throw then going to be taken by Matty Waldridge. Throws it as far as he can into that box. The AT flicks it on. It looks like it's going to go in. Go. And there we go. Come on. Come on, boys. That's one back. Come on, boys. Like I said, when the ball is in that position, anything can happen, Wyatt. And Jermaine has stuck it in the back of the net. That man again, Jermaine. He's just there when you need him, isn't it? It's just what he does, isn't it? It's just what he does. Right, come on then, boys. Still a big mountain to climb. We've got, what, four, just shy of four minutes left. But like I say, anything can happen. And that is going to be it, guys. Hashtag lose 3-1 to Stone Market. You have to say fair play to them. They came here today with a game plan. They stuck to it. But you guys can see the league table now. Obviously, we're still in first place, um, although that gap has closed now between Hashtag and Sudbury. Reporting live from Stone Market. <laughs> the unbeaten run comes to an end. I was dreading this. I was thinking, when was it going to happen? And it happened today, man. 3-1. And to be fair to Stone Market, they played really, really well and they deserved the win. I'll be honest, they were all over us today. We weren't at the races today. I think the intensity kind of lacked a bit today. We were a bit lacklustre as a team. But it happens, man. It happens. And it's about how we bounce back. You know, obviously we've got another tough game next week against Coggleshaw Town, but it's at home. Yeah, so hopefully we can get the win. 3-1 loss today and it could have been a lot better, man. It wasn't the boys' best performance, but 21 games unbeaten, bruv. It was a long, long, long run. And Someone was bound, bound to beat us, man. And, and today was the day, man. And Stone Market was the team. Um, but we can't be down for too long because, to be honest, we ain't been too high, we ain't been too low, which is something Dev said as well, um, which is true. We've always remained humble in a way. So, you know, it, it's just one of them ones. It's how we bounce back. And a little bit of a reality check as well. Like, we ain't where we need to be. We ain't won the league yet either. Obviously, we've still got a few games left. Now it's six points. Uh, Sudbury won today as well. So obviously, it's still all to play for, man. It's still all to play for. It's an exciting, entertaining end to the season, man. We just keep going to the end, man. Uh, I didn't get the little girl's name. Uh, I forgot her name. I need her name. But yeah, she made this banner as well. Uh, we love you, hashtag. We tenure all the time at the top. So yeah, big her up. Big up her parents as well for bringing her to, to, the, to all the games. I know I see her dad and her mum at every game as well. So thank you for all your support. And the boys appreciate it. Yeah? Thank you very much. Hope you guys enjoy the vlog. Big up hashtag and big up Lockwells every single time. Yeah? What time is it? It's Teniola time. Like, share and subscribe, man. Yeah, Teniola TV over and out. Get me back to London, man. I let the beat play for the first eight. Big Teniola, yeah, I'm really bait.